Today I'd like to take a look at mobiles. I have this one hanging from my ceiling and it can be an excellent example of levers in action. So let's take a closer look. Levers are actually fairly simple. We need a lever, we need a pivot point or a fulcrum, and if we put two equal weights on opposite sides, the same distance away from that pivot point, it balances. Here's an example of equal weights. It doesn't matter that they're not hanging down the same length. The same weights are the same distance away from the fulcrum, so this roller becomes balanced. Now if we replace this weight with a heavier one, we would expect it to become unbalanced because the torque on this side is greater than the torque on this side. So if I move this piece closer, the weight of this is twice as much as this, so the distance is half as much. So this distance times this weight is going to be equal to this distance times this weight. And if I make this weight even heavier, same place, uh, it's unbalanced. If I move it closer, I would find a position where it does balance. And if I measure the distance here times the weight of this object, it would be equal to the weight of this object times this distance. This helps to understand how the lighter weights on one side of the string fulcrum can support and balance the heavier weights on the other side. Sometimes the weight of the bar itself comes into play. Right now this bar balances, but if I shift it over to the right, it's not balanced because the weight of the bar is adding more torque on this side than it is on this side. But if I have a heavy weight added to this short side, once again I can get it to balance. And we're going to see the same thing happening on the mobile. We can have the fulcrum off center, but the torques on both sides are going to be the same. A lot of weight for a short distance is going to be equal to a smaller weight plus the weight of the bar on the opposite side. One last thing to consider when putting a mobile together is to adjust the length and the height of the bars and blocks so that they're free to turn and don't bump into each other. 